An LLC is a living learning community. Uh, it's an opportunity for students to incorporate the academia also in their residence life. So to join in with other people who have like-minded interests. Mindful Living is focusing on thinking deeper into yourself and thinking more about who you are and the world around you and really just going into a deeper level, really <coughs> thinking about yourself on maybe levels that you might not have thought about yourself before and just try to figure out what you actually want to do with your life and things like that. It's really cool for people who are interested in learning more about themselves and um, learning about how they react to the world. Pretty much because of the fact that it's mindful, we have all kinds of activities where yoga and meditation and Aikido and just all kinds of things that really help you to get to know yourself better and get to know your friends and homemates and group members better. Um, as opposed to other groups that are more possibly academically based, we're definitely about people and each other and what's inside. It's a community of students who can explore what it is to be present to the moment, not dwelling on past, future, but being present to those thoughts and really being able to depend on themselves to really deal with those things that may be sometimes stressful, um, may be sometimes frustrating. It really gives it's an empowerment that allows students to really rely on themselves and others around them in the community to tackle these issues. For example, Mindful Living is the learning living community that I was in. And it's really nice because people can, uh, people are very close to people with like-mindedness and it's really cool to just be close to people like that and you get very tight-knit as a group. I think the people in it are just so open-minded and they're so willing to help you with anything you need. Um, if you have a problem, you always have someone to turn to. The Mindful Living LLC gives residents an opportunity to um, explore things that aren't typically explored together. Dropping some barriers, boundaries that may be automatically put up and letting them really get comfortable with one another, hang out together, eat together, study together.